I think it's because of that advocacy piece and, and the fact that it does listen to the, the issues of businesses is, is why I think it's very appropriate to call the London Chamber of Commerce the voice of business. You always would say, oh, the benefit is the leads and the business and, and all of this, but you know, in addition to that, a huge benefit is the personal growth. I learned a lot and I've been doing this for, for over 15 years and I'm still learning. You realize that a voice that McCormick wanted to have was going to be much stronger as part of a larger group. You know, it's great when you walk in and you're meeting with four or five executives who are going to spend a million dollars on furniture and they recognize you. They've met you somewhere before. It's very important to me to change the misconception that's out there in terms of the old boys club. Much more progressive, sure, back in the day. I'm certain it was maybe more of an old boys club. It isn't anymore.